Thanks you guys for coming tonight. Uh, my name is Brian. This is Tom. Tom Kaspersky. So uh, thanks for uh, thanks for coming. This is uh, Shinock Four. Um, just to give you a little bit of an overview. Tonight we're going to talk about Shinock background, uh, who we are, kind of what we're doing, our agenda for tonight, and then um, roadmap, what we're planning on doing for future meetings, um, how you can help, how you can get involved, um, and then also um, towards the end we're going to do uh, feedback and a book drawing. I do not think we have one of those books, but we have a book, uh, Bill's uh, book here. Uh, we'll be doing two drawings, so if you submit your feedback. Um, and then the most important part, the happy hour, so please make sure you come. <laughs> it's uh, not that far from here, from 9 till 11. Uh, it'll be uh, sponsored drinks. So um, first I want to thank our sponsors, uh, AIM6 Chicago, Server Central, and IIX. Um, we'd like to have uh, Mark Cooper from AIM6 just say a couple words. Um, yeah, we're really happy to sponsor Chinog. Um, we're happy to be here in Chicago, so Amsic Chicago is now live, thanks to the work of Aryan and his engineering team. You'll hear more about that later. Um, and we're really excited to support the networking community in Chicago. And um, we look, we'll look forward to working with you guys. And uh, enjoy the pizza and uh, have a good night. Thank you very much. Let's continue. Uh, background on China. So, this is Chicago Nog, uh, not to be confused with uh, Chino G, who apparently, if you Google it, is a gangster rapper. Um, something we found out later on, but that's not us. So any tweets with that, just so you know. I'm in the wrong place. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, so give you a little bit of background. We started in 2013. This is our fourth event by uh, me, uh, Tom Kaspinski, Brian McGann, also uh, Jason Kraft, who's not here. Um, this is our fourth event. Uh, if you're interested in finding out more about our previous events, please go uh, to our website, shinog.org. Um, but to give you a little bit of background on who we are, what we're trying to accomplish, what we're trying to do, um, we're a Chicago-based community for network professionals, uh, trying to provide the educational content uh, to kind of bring people together, also network with each other, and um, give certification advice. And this, this kind of started in 2013, one of Brian's classes, actually. Uh, so, Brian, if you want to kind of talk about how... Yeah, um, I'm in uh, IT training and I um, uh, was running a class here uh, local in Chicago that, uh, that Tom was in. And I was uh, telling the people in class that pretty much almost everybody I know is in another city or online, you know, LinkedIn, Facebook. And um, I've been doing this for like 15 years and I hardly know anybody local in Chicago. So. You know, me and Tom and, and uh, Jason, one of the other uh, guys that was in class, we were, you know, kind of kicking this idea around. This started as, as kind of like um, um, just a users group, like a, like a, a social group and a professional group. And, uh, you know, with your guys' help, with, you know, I can't believe this many people showed up, actually, on a Thursday night to talk about some nerd stuff and BGB peering and everything. So thank you guys for coming out. And uh, you know, hopefully, it's just going to continue to grow, and we'll uh, you know continue to run meetings. And um, just a quick note, guys: there's there's a bunch of seats in the front, so coming down, um, you don't need to be standing. We got some extra chairs. <laughs> um, so uh, our website is shinock.org. Recently, did a redesign, kind of cleaned it up. Um, that's where you can find all the information, on our future events, our uh, past events. Um, you know, a lot of information about who's attending this. Um, also, we have the PowerPoints and uh, videos of our, our previous events. Uh, this is also being recorded as well. So, um, one of the other things, um, you can subscribe. Right here, there's a little subscribe to blog. That's where anytime we blog or, or put anything up on the website, um, it'll be emailed to you so you don't have to keep on checking. Um, one of the other things we recently announced was a community uh, blogging. This was uh, a recent idea where we know that there's a lot of people out there that um, you know are not really great speakers, but they have a lot of um, knowledge. And uh, to kind of create a community, maybe a little bit offline, I mean online instead of instead of, instead of the meetings, uh, we wanted to have a community blog where uh, Shanag members contribute um, anything that they're kind of interested in. And there's a lot of benefits to that. For one, it, it does help the Shanag uh, community grow by bringing in that 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 content. Um, you're going to receive a lot higher uh, exposure versus if you started blo uh, blogging individually. Um, but then also you're going to start collaborating. Uh, things that are interesting to you, uh, you're going to have other people start commenting and really talking about, why is it doing that? Um, talking about um, common things. Uh, the other thing is you're going to receive the recognition of your work. A lot of times the network operators, they, uh, 
they do their work and nothing goes wrong, there's no outages and that's when they do a good job. But a lot of times it's when the outages happen and people start criticizing your work. Uh, so it's when everything goes well, um, you know, we're doing a good job, but we don't really get that recognition. With this, you can kind of contribute, show your work, uh, your research, kind of things you do, and put it on, online for other people to see. For other people to see. I want to quickly mention our sponsorship structure. So we're very thankful to our sponsors. This is the first time we had um, three big sponsors. Through this, we were able to have this uh, venue, t-shirts, uh, obviously the food, um, also the, uh, um, the happy hour afterwards. Um, uh, uh, book drawing and all that stuff. So uh, we introduced a new structure where we have full le four levels, diamond, gold, silver, and bronze. Uh, if you're interested in more in sponsoring, um, check out our website. There's a link there. But um, we are looking for sponsors for next event, for our next event, uh, for our next event. And uh, if you know anyone that's interested, if you work for a company that's interested, reaching out to this kind of a, a, a crowd, please let us know. Get in touch with us. Uh, a little bit more of who we are, who we are, uh, who are the people that are coming down here? I want to talk about a little bit, and uh, as you can see, it's kind of a small screen, but um, you can see that big chunk of people, basically network engineers. Fifty, fifty-three percent of you are network engineers. Uh, the rest are system administrators, um, uh, architects, uh, a lot of uh, directors of network engineering. So this is a very technical crowd. Um, we don't have any recruiters or uh, marketing people or anything like that. Um, in, in terms of the sector, which sector are people from? Instead of naming uh, companies, uh, decided to kind of break it up by a sector. Uh, the biggest one we have is IT consulting. Uh, we have financial, obviously Chicago is a big financial hub. Then we have educational, higher education, telecom, network hardware vendors, um, website companies, and things like that. So this is the audience that we have here. It's very technical, and, um, and these are the peers that are here tonight. tonight. Um, quick, uh, quick uh, kind of uh, introduction on the theme of, of uh, tonight. So tonight we're going to start off with with uh, interconnecting troubleshooting um, troubleshooting networks, uh, passive, active, and um, how you can kind of do that with um, uh, some of the different methods that are out there. And next we're going to go and talk about how networks actually interconnect. So a lot of you are engineers here, and you know how BGP works, how OSPF works. But um, to actually see the structure of outside of that one network, how networks interconnect, what's the economics, what's the uh, technology behind it, that gets, um, not a lot of people know about that because there isn't that much content about it. So hopefully, uh, hopefully tonight you're going to see that. And then um, our last speaker is going to talk about a use case where one of the points in the, in the internet, the internet exchange point, the biggest internet exchange in the world, um, how that's how, how it's set up, just kind of talk about a, a use case for that. Um, hopefully at the end you'll realize that you don't have to be a big ISP to peer. Uh, you could be a small enterprise, a website company, um, to take advantage of peering uh, by, by providing the extra security, better performance, um, lower telecommunication costs versus um, IP transit. So it's uh, just a quick reference. Uh, we have the programs for what exactly um, uh, the, uh, the agenda is. Uh, the roadmap. So our next meeting is going to be in 2015. We're planning on doing full, full day events, um, uh, about two to three a year. Um, kind of curious, how many of you would be actually interested in coming down to a full day instead of a uh, three hour evening? Is, it, is there interest in the community? Okay, well, that's a big <laughs> interest. Great, awesome. Um, also, uh, how can you help and how can you get involved? There's a lot of people that are interested in helping and getting involved in this. Uh, there's very simple things that all they require is a click. Uh, follow us on Twitter, retweet some of our tweets, spread the word uh, about Shinog. Uh, contribute to the community blog. It's a little bit more involved, but there's a big reward to that. Uh, tell your coworkers and friends. A lot of you work with uh, small teams of engineers or uh, your former coworkers. Let them know, have them come down. Um, the other ones help us find sponsors. Uh, sponsors are very important because they provide a lot of things we have here. And speakers. Speakers are, are what attract the content. Um, those are the two biggest things um, that we need help with. And then if you have any ideas uh, to improve Shinak, let us know. We have a feedback uh, form that we're going to do later on. Um, if you have ideas outside of that feedback, contact us. Use the contact us. Speak to me or Brian. Let us know because we want this to be uh, more of a community where everyone gets involved, everyone that has ideas uh, can contribute, and we can improve this and make this a, a, a kind of a, a worthwhile thing. Feedback. So like I was saying, at, after um, all the speakers, um, please go to feedback at shinock.org 
It's a quick Google form, about 10 questions. Most of them are multiple choice. If you put in your name in there, you'll be uh, entered to get um, two autographed copies of the internet, uh, internet playbook connecting the core to the internet uh, by Bill Norton, the author that's here. So uh, please do that. And we're gonna do a random drawing around a little bit after nine. And uh, after nine, the second part of this, uh, we're gonna go to Sullivan's, which is at Hubbard and Deborn. If you're interested in taking public transportation, it's about 12 minutes on the red line, not that far. Uh, if you want a cab, it, it's about $5. Um, people can kind of group together and get there. Uh, but yeah, so we'll have drinks from 9 to 11, uh, sponsored by um, AIM-6.